everyone welcome back to my channel this is modesty 33 here aka crystal with the c back at you with another video um this is just gonna be um this is kind of an impromptu video you guys but if you're new to my channel and you just happen to click on you're wondering what i'm all about check out some of my other videos on my channel i put out at least two videos a week one sit down one reaction video um well right now i don't know i might be taking a high it is from some of my reactions until the fall but we'll see i need to still finish marvel's runaways i may i don't know let me know if y'all want to see the rest of those reactions i can edit them and put them up i think i'm four episodes from being done and then i still have two i need to edit so let me know y'all but um i don't know when this video will go up maybe some of those reactions will already be out but i'm not certain but um just kind of depends on my schedule but um just want to kind of do this video today you guys but um again if you're not already please make sure you subscribe to my channel you do that by hitting the red button below and hitting the bell next to it so you're notified when I do upload future videos, which again, I do upload at least two videos a week. Um, and lately I've been doing reviews. I've been transitioning into my review videos and I've been really excited about that. Just recently put up a tag video on my channel, five luxury must have. So if you're interested in that, please check that out, you guys. But um, I'm doing like a really quick alpha of the day. I'm actually on my way to work. Um, and I need to, and then I'm going to Bible study tonight, but I may come back home before then, but I'm not certain, but this was just kind of one of those things I just kind of threw on because like, I don't, I'm not organized like that. I don't plan out my office. I don't typically work in the office. I work from home, but I have to go into the office today. So just kind of threw something on. Um, so just again, quickly, just want to kind of show you my little outfit. And this is typically something like I would probably wear on a date night. So you guys, my next date night movie video, if you don't see my date night outfit, I probably don't wear this same outfit out. I have no shame. So you may just see the review. <laughs> If I, if I choose to wear this out again, because I'm like, oh, okay, it look kind of cute though. But, um, yeah, I'm going to work today. So again, I just threw it on. I didn't feel like putting on anything else. So, um, that's what it is. But let me get a little bit closer. You can kind of see my hair. Oh, let me pull up. My hair is still a mini twist. I will take these out at some point, but they take so long to do. So yeah, as long as I can keep them in, they're going to stay in and then I'm going to untwist them and it will be. Yeah, you know, just a really defined twist out. But um, I don't have any makeup on today. Just have these earrings. I don't remember where I bought these earrings from. Maybe Versona, which is a store here in South Carolina. Maybe. But I really like these earrings. Um, lipstick is my tried and true Christian Louboutin um, 215 Broca Coat. It's what I have on my lips today. Um, my outfit, you guys, I think I got this blazer from, um, our thrift store. Our church has a thrift store. So I think I got this blazer from that thrift, from our thrift store some years ago. So, um, yeah, this dress right here, which it has pockets, which I love dresses with pockets, you guys, but it's just like a little kind of blue dress. And I bought this from New York and company probably about 12 years ago when I used to work in New York and company. So yeah, the clothes do last so yeah um and then um the shoes let me come down shoes are from rack room shoes um if you saw my memorial day haul you'll see in the unboxing of these particular shoes and i love them and they are comfortable and then my bag um i'm actually going to sit on the couch and do a what's in my bag um in the next clip and show you what's in this but um yeah, this is my bag for the day and I will talk to you guys about it more when I get on the couch. So that's kind of the impromptu nature of this video. Um, but it's just kind of easier for me to do like an outfit of the day in front of my mirror in my room. So I'm going to be back in the next clip, you guys, to just kind of be on the couch like we typically do. And I'm going to show you what's in my bag and tell you about my bag. All right. See you in the next clip, you guys. Bye. Hey, guys. Um, Welcome back. Um, hopefully you have seen the other clip where I did my outfit of the day. Again, it's just a little bit easier to do that in my mirror in my room because I haven't really mastered how to do that in the living room area and, you know, to get everything in the appropriate frame. So again, it's just easier to do it in my room, but hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Probably again, we'll wear this outfit again for a date night. So if, um, cause I'm really digging it today, but it's just something I threw on today because again, I really need to get to work and get a few things done. So, um, 
yeah, and I didn't feel like changing into something a little for me under. So, um, yeah. So again, if I do another date night or a movie night and you don't really, I kind of gloss over my outfit, it's probably because I've worn the same thing again. So anyway, you guys, I wanted to show you the bag that I'm wearing today. I'm broken. I'm breaking my rule. Typically, like I mentioned in my, um, review of my Pochette Matisse, which is the bag I am carrying for this month. Um, I do carry one bag for the entire month, but you guys, I've been itching to carry this particular item. So I just said, I'm going to give my Pochette Matisse a break for today. It's going to get the day off. And I was going to pull out this little, um, cutie right here, which this is my Louis Vuitton, um, Toilet Tree 26 in the Tahitian print Damia Azure. This was a limited edition item that came out, I think April of last year, um, from Louis Vuitton. So it was very limited. It is all sold out now. Fortunately, you guys, I did not purchase this when Louis Vuitton was selling it um, because I was on the fence about it. Then I kept seeing it in videos and all. And then when I got back from London, I just really, really wanted to get this little piece of my collection because this is actually the only Damier Azure item that I do have in my collection because I decided Damier Azure is just not for me. Um, most of the items in my wardrobe are like darker colors. So I feel like Damier Bean and Monogram work best for me. Um, and I do have my one on prompt pochette Matisse, which works as well as a red because again, like I said, I kind of wear it as a neutral and it's not too out there for my wardrobe. But I decided um, today I just kind of threw this on and I was like, oh, I really want to wear my Toilet 26 out. I really want to get more use of this. If I were to do a video of my least used items in my collection, this would probably be one or number one or number two surprisingly probably number one <laughs> will probably be my six ring key holder because i just love my um louis vuitton key clay so much so i use that to hold my keys um which is where my keys are on right now it's inside of this bag but um i do still use that as like for my work keys and kind of some other keys but i don't really i don't use that on a daily basis anymore and not have not done that for a very long time so this would probably be my number one least used item in my collection since I got it. I do use it. I have used it this year. Um, I typically will use this when I go out of town on trips and vacation um, as a toiletry pouch to carry some different items because it does have a wipeable interior. Um, but, you know, again, I, most of the colors in my wardrobe are kind of darker, so I don't really carry this um, like out as a clutch. But I am doing so today, so I thought it was a special occasion to celebrate and to mark so i'm gonna be doing a what's in my bag of this particular um toiletry 26 so you can see what fits in here and it is huge you guys but um yeah i really i really do like it um, i thought about selling it actually but um the thing is it is very difficult to um acquire um, um not even just this particular piece because like i said this one is sold out um louis vuitton no longer sells it so you do have to buy it second hand um which it's gonna typically be higher in price. So, um, but like even just a Toilet Tree 26 anyway, just regular monogram, they're very difficult to acquire. So, um, you know, I was on the fence about that. I was like, well, I really wanted to have a Toilet Tree 26 and I kind of use it as a clutch. So um, I don't really wanna sell it because of that. And again, this is the only Dami Azure piece in my collection. And, you know, it is a special edition one at that. So decided that I'm, you know, I'm not interested in selling it right now. I am going to try to use it and implement it more with my bags or items. When I do use this as a toiletry pouch, I do keep it in the dust bag. Um, like when I carry in my Neverfull, if I carry in my keep all just to prevent color transfer, because as you will see, it is a lighter colored item. So let me just show you um, a little, this a little bit closer. This is what it looks like. It is the Dami Azure print, but it does have this um, pink screen printed um, on the canvas, which is really beautiful. And it is on the bottom as well. And on the back, and that's what it looks like. Just very big and bright. Well, it's actually not that bright. It's kind of muted. It's like a pale pink maybe like a rose ballerine, you know, kind of the way I can describe it. Um, it does not have the um, screen printing on the sides of the bag though. So it is just regular Dami Azure on the sides. And um, this item was made in France. You can see that. Yeah, yeah, made in France. 
And um, let me just show you what I have on the side here. On the side, I have this little chain that I bought from eBay, probably like five or six dollars, just to kind of wear it so I could wear it as a clutch. Um, here I also have my lottery bag charm, which I put on every bag, but it is especially fitting for this particular bag because of the color. So really complements it very well with the gray, as well as like with the pink and the gray and the black here. So really like this item on this pouch. And then this is just my keys and my sanitizer, which I'm just kind of hanging them from inside the bag. This is what it looks like up top. It's maybe a little bit distorted, you guys, but that doesn't really bother me. So we're gonna open this and see what is inside. So I'm gonna pull you guys a little bit closer just so you can see. Um, well, actually, yeah, let me bring it down a little bit so you can see. All right, so yeah, let me pull this for you guys. This is what all of my items inside look like. So you will see them all here. And the items that I don't have in here that are typically in my Pochette Matisse are in my Neverfull. That's what I'm wearing again as my work bag out for today. And I'm just kind of carrying this as a clutch. So let's go ahead and let me show you my items. Let me make sure everything is good. Okay. So yeah, everything is in here. First thing, I have um, some checkbooks. Then I also have my um, key clay, which is where my keys and my sanitizer. Um, I have some cards and cash in here as well. Um, I also have ink pen. Then I have, um, this is my work phone. It's the iPhone 6 Plus. Well, no, not a 6 Plus. It's the iPhone 6S. I'm sorry. It's my work phone. Then I also have my um, iPod Touch, 128 gigabyte that I just got not too long ago. This is um, my lipstick that I'm wearing for today. This is the Christian Louboutin um, lipstick in the 215 Roca Coat. Um, you guys have seen this before. I just did a um, review of luxury lipsticks and this was the top of my list if you haven't watched that video. <laughs> and this is kind of like my daily lipstick. Again, this is the Christian Louboutin. It is a luxury lipstick. It is expensive, but I truly love it. It is my daily lipstick at this point. And this again is the 215 Broca Coat. So that's what I have on my lips today and typically every day. Um, let's see. Next item, I have mints here. These are out toys. I almost dropped those. And this is in the peppermint. Next item, I have my Louis Vuitton on um, prank clay. And this is um, in the color earth, which is like a kind of like a dark brown. So it does have like a zip pocket on um, the back. And then I just have like cards in here. So I'm kind of using this as like a wallet. Um, let's see. And I also have a um, eyeglass lens cloth here. I have, what else? My lotion, most importantly, my lotion. This is um, a Bath and Body Works lotion and this is in um, Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. I have that in here. And then I also have one of my other favorite lip products, which is the Dior Attic um, Lip Glow. And this is, um, in the 007 color, which is raspberry. So it's just kind of like this um, pink right here. So I usually wear this underneath, you know, any lipstick that I'm wearing. So it is underneath this 215 Roca Coat. So really love this. And that's another highly recommended lip product. Um, in here, I just have um, some gum. This is Trident Layers. And this is the flavor watermelon and tropical fruit. Watermelon and tropical fruit, I can't say that. And then the last item I have in here, yeah, that's the last, is my Louis Vuitton mini pochette in the Damier Abim pattern. And let's see what's in here. So in here, this is kind of what that looks like. I just have a MAC lipstick, um, liquid lipstick. This is in the color So Me. I have um, a, you know, a few ginger mints are in here. That's another ginger mint. I have a, um, this is a like extra charger for my phone. I have that in here. Um, I also have tweezers, another ginger mint. Um, I have a Claritin um, for allergies. I also have a leaf for headaches. Um, and I have a, my NARS, um, 
This is a blush, but I use it as a mirror. I got this again from Ulta for like a birthday reward. So I um, highly recommend you sign up for Ulta so you can get your, you know, birthday rewards every year. So this is um, the NARS blush in the color Orgasm. And then it has like a little mirror on the inside, which I really love it since it's compact. I haven't used the blush yet, but um, I really love the mirror. And then this is another mirror that I don't need because I have that one now. But this is what this looks like on the inside. It is very dirty. It's very used, very loved. But um, yeah, and I also got this pre-love from eBay as well. So um, yeah, that's it. That's everything that's inside of my toiletry 26 pouch, you guys. And this is what it looks like. It is a very beautiful like pink interior. I don't know if you can really see that in the lighting. It is a wipeable interior. So like, again, it's a toiletry pouch. So, you know, it's used for like shampoo, makeup, different items like that that could potentially spill over. So if they do, you know, no, no sweat, you can just take a wipe and just clean it out on the inside. So that's what I really do like about this. So again, you guys, that's everything that's in my toiletry pouch that I'm carrying for the day as a clutch for work. Um, again, I thought about selling it, but gonna try to implement it more and i'm gonna probably end up keeping this for now anyway i may sell it in the future but you know not right now but again guys that's everything hope you enjoyed that um if you did make sure you give this video a thumbs up also make sure you share this with anyone else who may be looking to see how if they have a toiletry 26 how they can wear it as a clutch and what items can fit inside so make sure you share that with anyone else or if you have one yourself now you have some ideas of what all will fit inside of your toiletry 26 pouch um, also make sure, um, you, you know, comment below, let me know again, um, if you have one, if you, um, have this particular item or this piece, or, um, you know, if you have a toiletry 26 pouch and how you use your pouch, um, you know, again, also make sure most importantly, before you leave this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel. You do that by hitting the red button below and making sure you hit the bell next to it. So you're notified when I do upload future videos. So again, you guys, I thank you so very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in my very next video. Bye.